So secret number two is that you can use leverage to reclaim time for future you. Uh, and we're going to talk right. about how to automate unlimited copy and paste, how to have a minimum acceptable day habits that you don't break the chain, and why leverage lists are greater than to-do lists. Um, and so the first framework uh, is literally going to save you hundreds of hours of your life. Uh, it has saved me over a thousand hours since I discovered it uh, about nine years ago. It also allowed me to raise $10,000 in less than a day and a half, uh, and I did it twice. And so first, I want to show you this video. Universe. This is Georgetown. Georgetown. With the, with the, with the, Oh my god! Oh my god! I cannot believe I saw that! Oh my god! Nationals for the first time uh, in school history. And so I was able to leverage that video and this tool I'm about to introduce you to, and we raised more than 10 grand in, in less than a day and a half. Uh, all of the alumni, the people who you know had come through the program, friends and family, helped fund the team to you know get on a plane, fly to Milwaukee uh, in 2018. And so, uh, and, and it was also number four on SportsCenter Top 10 uh, Sunday morning that weekend. Um, wow, that's really cool. And so the tool uh, is called Brevi, and Brevi is a text expander software for Windows. It helps you type faster and more accurately uh, and allows you to abbreviate an infinite amount of um, an infinite amount of text that you can replace with these short um, keyboard shortcuts. So, for example, all of the different Calendly links that I send out, I have little C links whatever they might be. Um, I don't have my business's EIN number memorized, but if a form asks me to fill it out, I type EIN semicolon and it pops right in. Um, I have over 150 uh, keyboard shortcuts in there. So when you ask, what are your favorite keyboard shortcuts? Right. I'm like, well, I do CC link a lot for my Calendly. I do CV link for my other Calendly. I do LIGSI for the GSI link tree that points to a bunch of things. Um, I do uh, Z link for my Zoom link because it's the same URL for all my Zoom meetings. Um, I have MI Web fills out the Malloy Industries website, and then Whoa. MI Web S is our service, MalloyIndustries.com slash services, uh, and a variety of other um, links that I send frequently, especially things that are Google Docs or Airtable links that are, are pretty long and ugly, and I will never remember them. Um, I just think of, uh, oh, this is actually the Wu-Tang music video for Cream. I share, I share that video so much that I added a, a shortcut for it, so I wouldn't have to go to YouTube, search for it, copy and paste it. And what I have found is uh, a best practice here, Mackenzie, is that the second time you go to copy and paste something, create a shortcut for it. Because you're gonna probably have a third time or a fourth time or a hundredth time that I've you know shared a Zoom link or Calendly link. Um, right. And if you were a Mac person, uh, you could also do it on the Mac. They have text replacement. Um, and you know it's basically, uh, as I mentioned, you want to save it for later. Uh, I use a trigger key, so I type in the keyboard shortcut and I push semicolon, and that then you know replaces the text. Um, and perhaps also very helpful if you're an iPhone user, you could do it on your phone. Uh, and so I don't have all of my laptop ones on my phone, but I do have like P1 is my cell phone. I have my Calendly link. I have different websites and link trees and Airtable forms that I know I, I text people about uh, saved on my phone. So I just type in a few characters and then it will, uh, you know, recommend you replace it. So uh, 11 out of 10 recommend getting Brevi. I think they give you 30 days for free to try it. And it's $35 once for the rest of your life. It's like by far the best thing you can buy to uh, save time for future you.